Ciao and welcome to your polling predictions on the ones updated bi-monthly by your committee program. In Sweden, Ipsos and other forecasts call for continued social democracy as everyone's favorite Labour Party continues to lead the pack with their new Prime Minister in tow. Although continued strength in the Conservative Moderate Party and Swedish Democrats prevents welfare utopia from proceeding unimpeded. In Colombia per Detexico we have high approval ratings for the three highest performing candidates, Galan for the Liberals, Maquets from the center-left SPA, and Fajardo of the ASI Indigenous Party at 53, 51 and 45 percent respectively. Similar story in Pakistan per Gallup, where the chief minister approval ratings are running fairly even in the mid-50s for Mehmood Khan PTI centrist, Murad Ali Shah PPP center-left, Usman Buzdar PTI centrist, although Mr. Khan has improved his position considerably since this was last measured at the expense of the other two. In Japan we see the conservative LDP party dominating party identification with 47% of the Japanese people choosing blue. The closest center-left party, the CDP, blows in at just 8 points, this per ANN polling. Sigma Conseil is reporting that Tunisia should have a close parliamentary election with the right PDL party hovering at 32%, roughly where Sayed's party likewise occupies. We are finally seeing temperatures plummet for the once hot Labour Party of New Zealand led by Jacinda Ardern, but current surveys from Oceana Elects have just behind the right-wing National Party. Finally, in Costa Rica, we are seeing initial looks at a blowout against the ruling center-left PAC party. From our staff here at the Polling Channel, thank you so much for watching and farewell.